Yeah. But I say that to say the story about the brown the brownie incident. So check this out, yeah. All right. Okay, yeah, I'll go ahead. We had, we had a little uh dresser nightstand in our uh what was that room? Like the laundry room. Mm-hmm. So my, my dumb ass, you know, I'm sniffing out food, trying to find what's cracking, what's going on. No, it was in the kitchen on the no, counter. No, no, no. It was all the, it was all, no. It was, oh. you, you walk in. Tim's and, brother had just came over and dropped yeah. off the brownie. No, Mark, left that thing right there. And I'm sitting thinking, oh, he left, oh, somebody went to, went to 7-Eleven, got a brownie. So I'm going, I grabbed the brownie. Now, normally, people, like, break off a piece of a brownie. They'll eat it, nibble at it, whatever. My dumb ass just, I, I, but uh, wait a minute, y'all. First off, it was not his. It was not mine. And he already knew, don't go eating other people's food. We didn't do that. But except for Philip would go and get people's stuff. Tim was always in his behind about eating his food. And I would get on him about something that was mine or him eating it. So go ahead with the brownies. So then I ate the brownie. And I'm laying it. I'm so I go in my room, right? I laid out. I had a, a wooden panel bed. And I'm laying in like nice little bed. I'm laying in the bed. All of a sudden, like shit got really fuzzy. <laughs> and I'm looking around. I had even y'all remember the glow of the dark stars that you would put on your ceiling. I'm looking at the stars, and my room was painted blue, like crip blue for no reason whatsoever, right? Because that's what you wanted. I wanted the blue. So blue. I'm like, and I'm sitting spiraling left from looking. I'm doing this. And I'm I'm spread eagle across the bed. And I was like, and I told myself, just just play it off. Like I'm saying, play it off, play it off, play it off. We're going to be all right. I was in my room with the door closed. I didn't know you was going through nothing. I was going through, I was going, I was falling. And all I heard, and I remember I heard Tim say, Carla, come here. And I was just, I was fucked up. <laughs> what because, did it look like? For your because room? Tim came in the room and he said to me, he said, did you eat some of that brownie? And I was like, no, I haven't eaten anything. And uh, he said, I think Philip ate some of that brownie. Well, I immediately jumped up and went in his room because I didn't never hardly go up in there, y'all, because y'all can about imagine. Not less, as long as I didn't smell no stench coming out of there, I was like, whatever, after a while, you know, when they get to be teenagers or whatever, unless he, he caught me on a day and I would go in there and rule with a heavy hand and make him clean it up. So, but when Tim said he ate that brownie, I was like, uh, you know, I was... I was like, oh, no, because you had to be in what, 13, 13. 14, 13. 13, I was 13. And I bust up in there and I don't really remember. I All I can really remember is you was laid out up in there. And I think I I think I didn't say anything to you. I didn't. You ask said you. That. I, didn't, I don't think I even asked you because I really didn't want you to know about no brownie or whatever. But you probably knew about more things than what I, I did. But I, did. I, okay. I thought my dumb ass was sitting there thinking it was just a 7-Eleven brownie. But the shit had me fucked did up. Did you know that it must that was no? It tasted just normal. No, not tasted. But after you started spinning, what well, did you I, think? well, first I sat. First I sat on the edge of the bed. Then I couldn't get comfortable, so I was like, uh, 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 tossed around, flipped around, laid there. When I locked in that position of just this, my arms spread like laid uh, wide open. Everything. Oh, I was stuck, and I heard voices. But I couldn't say shit. Yeah. That was some of the best sleep I ever had in my life. I, I, was I like, think oh. later on when we talked about it, you did tell me that it was some of the best sleep that you had. I, I don't think I said, I didn't say anything. I didn't ask no questions. It wasn't nothing to really, but I kept, I didn't get any sleep that night because I kept going in there looking, going in there looking, or making Tim go in there, open the, go in there. Make sure I'll swallow my tug. That's the stuff. Yeah. Go in there and make sure. I was like, oh my God. We didn't talk about it for, to, for years later, did we? No, nah, we ain't talking about it. Because I, I was too scared to say anything. If I did, I don't remember if I said something to you or if Tim said something to you. Stop eating other people. I think I, I told always you said that I still ate shit. I don't care. And Stop I would eating do other that. people's food. I still would die. Well, I don't do it like I used to. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I.